Two former UW Oshkosh basketball players got married just over a year ago in Middleton. One month later, they found out they were expecting their first child, or so they thought. Yeah, sports director Carly Murata has you covered on the unusual news that would change Madeline and Taylor Jansen's lives forever. It was June of 2022 that Madeline and Taylor Jansen were heading to their first doctor's appointment after learning they were going to be first-time parents. You're nervous for, excited for, just like ready to like see that flutter, hear the heartbeat, all of that. But they would soon find out it wasn't just one heartbeat. We called it. Okay. Uh, um, there's, there's, uh, hold on, because there's more that's actually free. Okay. And when the doctor looked at the images, she found even more shocking news. I mean, I've never seen it, and everyone that I had talked to had never seen it. Dr. Marissa Slusher explains Madeline's uterus is shaped like Mickey Mouse ears. She had one baby on one side and identical twins on the other side. How? And then my second thought was, are they all okay? The combination of her uterine shape, which is about 1% of the population, with the triplets, which is also super rare, it, it's really hard to even like put into words how neat and also a little nerve-wracking and also really exciting it all was. Dr. Slusher explains that for triplets alone, there's an over 90% chance that one or multiple of the babies will be premature. Combine that with her uterine shape and she had a very high-risk pregnancy. I'm a coach, so it was all about give me the game plan, tell me what I need to do, and I'm going to go execute it. The game plan was to meet with the doctor every single week with the goal of making it through Christmas before going into labor. Christmas, I was going to be 28 weeks, which once you get to 28 weeks, um, babies have a, a really good chance of surviving. Madeline surpassed that mark and every milestone, making it to her scheduled delivery date of February 21st at 36 weeks pregnant, the day they had been dreaming about. Not only did the Jansons have three healthy babies, but the babies never left the delivery room. We had doctors just telling us this is going really well. They, I mean, the biggest thing was that they told us that hit home with me at least was just be happy there's no Nikki here. I mean, that's mm -hmm. the big thing. There was still one big surprise, the genders. She said, well, Taylor, you are outnumbered <laughs> and we have three girls. And that day, I mean, people say best day of your life. Hands down, one of the best days of my life. One, two, three. Okay, so we have brought the babies into the interview. <laughs> Here they are. Three months into being parents of three, the word teammates has taken on a whole new meaning. The one who's left with all three is in a full court press. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, you're, you're down 20 and you're waiting for your teammate to get back in the yeah. game. <laughs> Little did Madeline know, she had been training for this her whole life. I think being a college athlete, she is so used to pushing her body to such extreme limits that in some ways a difficult pregnancy um, was just like another thing. Her positivity is so infectious. She's a rock star. As a mom, you know, she's killing it. Uh, <laughs> these babies absolutely love her. Amelia, Emerson, and Charlie completing the Jansons' starting five. A miracle, yeah. and it's amazing. It's just amazing that they're here. In Middleton, I'm Carly Murata for Hi. 27 News. Hi. She does look at the big smiles. And Madeline is an assistant coach for UW Oshkosh women's basketball. She actually coached practice the night before delivering <laughs> wow. the babies. She looks forward to continuing her career on the sidelines and having a team full of babysitters. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Such a cute story. Yeah, and I love that you were holding yeah. one of the babies. <laughs> that was amazing. Um, but you've been friends with mm -hmm. Madeline for years, right? So yeah. How, how is she doing? How is she holding up? Because that pregnancy alone just must have been incredible for her. Yeah, we've been friends with Madeline and Taylor for so long. I'll never forget the day that Madeline told me this. But honestly, they're two of the most positive people I've ever Aww, met. Yeah. Taylor just went back to work. So Madeline is on her own with all three babies. No complaints. So positive and just so grateful for everything. Yeah, and indeed, this was also a special delivery for the doctor as well in that story. Yeah, Dr. Slusher is absolutely amazing. She was an amazing interview, but what was really cool is she delivered the babies on her birthday as well. Wow. <laughs> yeah. How about that? Special day all around. Just a happy, happy story. Love that yeah. story, Carly. Thank you so much.